In this video, we are going to understand the term aggregate supply. The formal definition goes like this. Aggregate supply of an economy is the amount of output produced by firms in the economy. So if you see that we are talking about total amount of output in an economy. Let's say for example, we are taking India as a country. Therefore, we are also talking about the Indian economy. Now aggregate supply of Indian economy means the total amount of output produced by firms. So all the firms that are there in this country, that is in India, we are going to calculate the total amount of output. All right, now that you have understood the definition, we will go forward in understanding a little more about this aggregate supply. So if you see normally, there is a direct correlation between supply and price. Because as a firm, you want to make profit by selling your output. In that case, there has to be a price for your output. That's a whole different matter if you're willing to give it for free, but generally there is a price for an output. I want you to consider this. If people are willing to pay more money for a product, the supply of that product increases because then the firms find it lucrative to produce that particular product. And that's how the market has availability of that product for the consumers. So if I were to plot a graph, uh, let's make a graph. On the X axis, we have quantity and on the Y axis, we have price. Now a supply curve looks upwards from left to right. Again, the meaning goes, as the price of a product goes up, the supply also goes up. Now, apart from prices, there are other factors that have an influence on supply. This could be like the price of raw materials, then technological innovations, competition and government regulations like subsidies and producers taxes. These all have direct influence on the supplier industry. Some of them causes positive changes in aggregate supply, while the others cause decline. I hope now you have a better understanding about what is aggregate supply. If you want to see more of such educational content, make sure you're subscribed. By doing so, you'll get an alert when my next video comes. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.